Yeah, y'all youngsters weak as hell these days. Mm. I ain't never seen a generation of kids so weak. So fucking weak. Nah, we ain't weak, fam. We strong in our own way. Nah, y'all weak as bitch on everything. That It makes no sense. How we weak, huh? Tell me something. Y'all scared to go to school because of school shootings, gun control, all this shit. Hell, we got shot three times at school every day. It was mandatory. It was part of the curriculum. Every student had to get shot three times a day. And we look at, look at the world. We turned out just fine. We grew up to become the politicians, the lawyers, the governors, the people that run America today. We grew up to become those people. And look at what we turned the country into. Yeah, Unc, I hope that ain't you saying that, that the country good right now. I hope that ain't what you're saying. Is that what you're saying? That's exactly what I'm saying. My generation was tougher than yours, better than yours, and we grew up to take the, take the reins. We took the wheel over the generation before us. We are the people in power in America. And look at how we run in the country that you live in today. Yeah, it sound like y'all y'all fucked up to America, don't it? Uh, you know? Y'all took the country from the people who was in power when you was a kid, and made it fucking worse you know you didn't you didn't fix what they screwed up you screwed that shit up even more i don't remember i don't remember that <laughs> but y'all up here talking about some and depression anxiety ptsd mental health stuff we ain't have all that when i was growing up that didn't none of that exist my mama used to get her ass beat by my daddy every day my daddy worked 55 hours a day to put bacon on the table and we turned out perfectly fine but y'all can't get hollered at and you're crying. Unk, I love you, but but grandma holler every time somebody slam the door too loud. She she shit herself. She's scared. You can't even yell too loud without her having a breakdown. What you call that, normal? She breaking down. She on 15 pills a day. She walk around with a machine and a cane. She can't eat certain foods. Her stomach is disintegrating. What you... What part of this is perfect? And you know that's just what happened to people when they get old. It's natural to get old and just start breaking down and just fall into shit. So you sit there with a straight face and tell me that you think it's normal and it's supposed to happen that when a human gets older, as they get older, they just, just get worse. They just get worse. You know, they mind go. They just basically... To be human means to get old and fall the fuck to pieces. Yeah. It's impossible to be 70 and able to run full speed. And with that logic, you feel like you perfectly fine? Really? Mm-hmm. My generation was able to go to war. One man could go to war and kill 15 people and come back and raise two kids and have a wife and be perfectly normal. Nothing wrong with him. Mm. You know, we ain't worried about the fact that, you know, he probably got addicted to drugs, molesting his kids, raping his daughter, or either making his daughter come to the family reunion around the rapist. You know, because he didn't believe her when she said uncle raped her, unk. But anyway, yeah, I'm just saying, nephew, I'm just saying your generation soft, uh, what y'all call it, slime. That's all I'm saying. Y'all want people to raise minimum wage because you can't afford to live off of a job. In my day, I could have worked at McDonald's and bought a house. We got it out the mud. Um, I love you. But bitch, if y'all had to get it out the mud, that means we, we must be getting it out the fucking bedrock because... A 22-year-old person cannot work at McDonald's and even afford rent for a one-bedroom apartment. Rent, lights, water, and not even Wi-Fi. Just the basic shit. He can't do none of that. And internet is damn near a necessity these days. So what you, what you saying, Uncle? I love you. What you, you saying stupid shit.